back to my channel and if you're new here I'm Eileen and this is Eileen Ashley is red hot and flashy the other day I asked you guys to comment what you guys would like to see on my channel and there were a lot of great suggestions and I will be working on them one of the suggestions was uh, asked if I could show how I put on false eyelashes now I know it's difficult um, it takes lots of practice but we're gonna do it today. The first thing I'm gonna do is put on some mascara. This way, the, uh, you know, my red lashes will match the black lashes I'm about to put on. And it, it's just one coat, that's all you need. I'm going in with the uh, Benefit Roller Lash. If you hear that buzzing, I have the fan on because I'm sweating. And yes, the air conditioner is on too. <laughs> I just did the top lashes for now. The lashes I'm gonna use today, um, I purchased from a small business and the business name is Lizzie Lashes. And I'll put a link to the website down below in case you're interested. But I kind of met the um, owner through social media and she's so sweet and I love her lashes. So this is how they come. They came with that. And inside, I just thought this was the sweetest thing. So here, here's the lashes. And it comes with a spoolie so that you can clean your lashes. And these hair clips so that you can put your hair back. Like mine is blowing in my face right now. <laughs> And this way, your hair is out of the way when you're putting in your lashes. I thought that, oh, I look funny as hell, but I thought that was so cute. I also got from her the um, eyeliner um, adhesive. I guess that's what it's called, right? But look at how cute it's all blinged. And it's in the shade of black. Now, if you don't want to use an eyeliner, um, you know, maybe you have red or something like that on. You don't want to use black uh, eyeliner adhesive. I would suggest, especially if you're new, to use um, this, which is Duo. It's from Duo, and it's the green one. Because the tubes are just so hard to use when you're a beginner. So I'll show you really quick what it looks like. So it comes in a wand, and you just... You can either put the glue there or on the lashes. Today I'm going to use Lizzie Lashes um, eyeliner adhesive. But the first thing we have to do when applying lashes is measure them. So you can use tweezers. They have uh, eyelash applicators, which look like this. Ardell lashes include applicators that look like this. And I happen to like these because it comes with this, it's kind of rubbery. Um, I don't know what, what you would call it, but you can actually push the lash down into the glue. I, I like that for that. Or you could just use your hands. Hopefully you get a really good look at these. These are so nice. I don't know if you could see that. They're, um, they're so silky. I love them. All right, now we're going to go in and measure them. And it helps that there's a little tiny bit of adhesive on here. It's just barely tacky i mean it wouldn't stay on your eyes um from them uh you know being in here so i'm going to take a tweezer and i'm just going to hold them up to my eyes just to get an idea of how much they need to be cut now in this instance it's kind of straight so i'm over here i'm i'm playing it with it I wish you could see better, but it, it, you see I'm trying to um, kind of make it curved for my eye, eyeball. You know, we all have different shaped eyes. But just so I can get a better idea as to how much, if anything, I need to cut off. Ooh, look how pretty they are. So they are a little long for me. And as you can see, they flare out at the end. But because they're so long... I'm gonna cut from that flared out end. 
because I don't want too much of the middle to be flared out. So I'm gonna take a little scissor like this and I'm gonna start cutting in, you can see they're kind of like in little sections here. And I'm gonna take a little section off and then remeasure and see, see if I need to take any more. It kind of looks like it's only uh, one that I need to take. Okay, let's put it up to our eye again. I think I actually need to cut a little more off. Now I'm gonna cut from the inner corner, just so it's even. Let's measure really quick one more time. I'm just gonna hold it with the tweezer because that stickiness is off. Perfect. Next I'm going to take um, the eyeliner adhesive and I'm going to draw on my eye exactly like I would if I were putting eyeliner on. But I'm going to need a mirror for this. I cannot do this in the phone, in the camera here. So if you have trouble doing eyeliner, I know that I have trouble with liquid eyeliner and it's because of my hooded eyes. But what I do is close your eye, get as close to your, um, your lash bed there and just do it real slow, like in sections, instead of just drawing a line. And you're gonna make sure that you get from the first lash to the very last lash. And you have to do a decent size line, not real thick, you know, because you wanna make sure that the lash band on the false eyelashes are going to stick. There's gonna be enough adhesive there for it. So I'm just gonna shut my mouth and do this. Okay, and this is what it looks like. It looks like I have black eyeliner on, right? Let's give that a second to dry down a little bit. You wanna let the adhesive, um, especially glue, dry down a little bit until it gets tacky because otherwise the eyelash just uh, slides around and it creates a mess. You only have to wait about 30 to 45 seconds. All right, now we're ready to place it on. You put in your tweezer, or you could use your fingers, whatever you're more comfortable with. And we're just gonna place it on our eye. And we're not gonna really press down yet. Once it's on like that, then we could go in, like I said, fingers or tweezers, and press down those two ends. just like that. Here's where I like to use the end of these uh, applicators. This way, you kind of doesn't, it doesn't get messy. And you just press down on the lash band. And then take your finger and kind of, you know, press your lashes with um, the false eyelash. Oh my God, I love these eyelashes. Look at how pretty they are. I would say, oh, it's just that simple. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, they're hard to master putting on false eyelashes. I'm gonna go off camera and do this eye really quick. Be right back. Hi guys, aren't they beautiful? I just love them. <laughs> Not only do I love the actual lashes themselves, you know, the hairs, the lash band is thin enough where, you know, you don't, you don't have a big thick band and it's hard to work with but it's not too thin and it's not flimsy either. So it makes putting on the lashes so much easier. The last thing I'm gonna do is go in with the uh, mascara and do my lower lashes. And there you have it. We have false eyelashes. I know that it's still really difficult. You know, when I first started applying eyelashes, it was hysterical how bad it was. <laughs> my biggest problems that I'm gonna advise you guys to look out for is number one, I did not wait long enough for the glue to dry down. So they kept moving and it was it was just a mess. It was, it was a mess. The other was that I didn't have enough glue on the ends, so that kept lifting. So once I mastered how to do that, it became a lot easier. It just takes some practice. I hope you guys liked today's video and I hope that you, I was able to teach you guys how to put your lashes on. If you do and you happen to take a picture and post it on Instagram, tag me in it so that I can see how beautiful you look. 
And if you're interested in these lashes or anything from Lizzie Lashes, I'm going to link the uh, website in the description. Don't forget. And support small business. They need us. The conglomerates, they don't need us. Well, they do technically, but they have enough business. I think we should support each other. And she supports my channel, which I can't thank her enough. And I think uh, anytime you need new lashes, go support her. If you like today's video, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget, hit that subscribe button down there below. Come join our family. And don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a new video. Oh, for those of you who are interested in the Michaela X Glam Light giveaway, I have an extra chance for you guys. I told you I was going to hide it in these videos. Hopefully you watched till the end. For today's extra entry, I'd like you to leave a comment below telling me where you came from. Did you see me on Instagram, TikTok? Did you just happen to scroll on YouTube? Did somebody refer you to me? Let me know in the comments below and I will give you an extra entry. And guess what, guys? I started seeing people already. They're getting their um, emails telling them that their packages have shipped. Mine has not yet, but hopefully it'll be soon. Until next time, everybody. Bye.